Oh yes, holding both of your bag straps is definitely going to help you. It makes you go faster. It's how you activate like the super speed. <laughs> I'm sorry, Taylor, but the only way to go faster is to not Ruto run your way around places. <laughs> Also, I love that. What are you doing on the ground? You literally pushed her yeah. into the ground. <laughs> ah, yes, the cool uncle with the with the way too low V-neck. Oh, thank you, thank you. Somebody else has seen that. <laughs> literally, in the script, I just keep calling him cool over and over again because, like, that's clearly what he's going for. It's, it is the aviators, the V-neck that's way too low, and like the baggy blue jeans with some shitty Adidas like gazelles. You just know that if this movie was like better funded the only changes that you'd make of this car would be a ferrari <laughs> or a lamborghini aventador no nah, no nah, it'd, it'd be a it'd be a porsche after all she was freshly 18 when this was oh, filmed sorry yeah the look in his eyes as well he's like ah yes you're mine you've signed a contract that you can't get out of Mwahaha. it's not even a very good hazy effect no it's not it just looks like somebody's got a camera out of focus or a camera from like a Motorola 3000. I think that's exactly what they did. I think they just slightly defocused the camera. Yeah, they only included this because their camera broke and they couldn't afford to fix it. <laughs> yeah, they did the shot last. Also, I'm sorry, what an absolute violation of a uniform that is. Should we do a drinking game? Just drink every time somebody gets naked or dies? Uh, no, because I love alcohol poisoning before I go to work tomorrow and I don't really want that. <laughs> Actually, I'll have alcohol poisoning I'll be like her. I'll be in a hospital. <laughs> and this is how she turns. And this is how she turns up to jail. She's ready. Yeah, she's just allowed to walk in. No police or nothing. She's nope. Elf surrender. Oh, oh yeah. And the pink suitcase is if that's going to get allowed pass. Yeah. I think it's because I think this film was copying or like trying to cash in on Orange Is the New Black. So like oh, obviously in the yes. first episode. She she gives herself up by yeah. self surrender. Yeah, she voluntarily goes to prison even though she had blatantly gotten away with it. You know he felt super cool when he was writing this. Mm. You know he felt super cool like directing himself as the cool uncle and then doing this like you could always become a fugitive. It's like shut up, Jared Cohen. Yeah. He wrote this and thought, I am the shit. <laughs> I, am, I am Billy Big Bollocks. I am the man, I'm getting a Grammy for this. Give me my Oscar, you <laughs> You'd be surprised at how learning self-defense can boost someone's confidence. I suppose it's not technically <laughs> prison, is it? Self-defense self, self, self defense is the reason she's got two years in this place. <laughs> but that, that, that's a good point, to be fair. <laughs> Hitting a girl with a pipe is the reason she got put into this place, and now they're saying, oh yeah, self-defense is the best way to shoot. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Learn to defend yourself. By the way, what are you in for? Assault. Defending myself. Like that. Oh, of course, that's out the something like that line. All, yeah, like something like that. Now, excuse me whilst I go and bang hookers, snort cocaine, kill. and smoke this cigar. Jared Cohn just looks like he's stunned. Right. He looks like he's starring in a 1980s Wes, uh, Wes Anderson movie. <laughs> just what, because of his shirt? Well, his shirt is jeans and that, like, screwy beard with... So. Screwy beard with, like, some really, like, Noel Gallagher-esque haircut. Yeah, he looks like he's going to a uh, an Oasis concert in like 1990. Mallory, just remember. So <laughs> Sally can wait. <laughs> she knows it's too late. <laughs> she's walking on by. You know. <laughs> You're my wonder. <laughs> just, <laughs> just, just grabs a guitar and just starts walking away slowly as she's like crying her eyes out. <laughs> You could always become a fugitive, Mallory just turns around. Maybe. <laughs> Remember, Jared, don't look back in anger. <laughs> now you can come with us. God opens the door, does not look at her, she could run. I ain't got all day, babe. Have you seen the videos of the stewards at football games? Like, just fans just walking straight through and the stewards not giving a shit. Yeah. That's exactly what she could do to these guards and just walk out. <laughs> they, would not, they would not care. Walk out. What are they going to do? <laughs> what, what, Beat you on the steps in front of your uncle? They're what, trying to maintain a facade here. 
what are they going to do? Catch me? I'm too fast. To, I'm like a weapon. What are they going to do? Shoot me? Ah, uh, the other white girl that looks like exactly her. Also, come on, prison guards would never let themselves be held up by, like, yeah. prisoners. Well, when she's fully integrated, I can believe them, like, not giving a shit what she does to Mallory, but, like... What? It's, it's, it's... They're trying to do something. Just fucking beat her up. Literally, do you remember that guard in the yard? He was, like, slapping a broomstick, even though she was sweeping yeah. the ground. Do you remember when I showed your friends in Newcastle this? That was uh, that was a very bad idea. Well, it, I just completely forgot how crap the film was. Well, it, it wasn't it wasn't even that. It was more the fact that you'd met them for what all of six hours, and then you're just blatantly showing yeah. them a movie that is just like. It was built for sex, fighting, and gambling, and the judge, the schools. Did they just put like the word sex in the post? The post audio. Yeah, that didn't sound natural, did it? No, it didn't. It was, it was as if like they added it, but then she didn't cut her off saying no. It's like fighting and yada yada yada. But mm. well, they also, who's she? Uh, she she literally never appears in the entire movie, her, uh, apart her, from maybe the next scene. It'll be her lackey. Uh, wait, on the phone, they listen in. Why is she surprised by that? That happens in literally every prison. You make a phone call, it gets monitored. Yeah, so do you not remember any of like the movies where it's just like, you have uh, you have a call from yada yada corrections. Do you accept this call? This will be like this will be monitored. Yeah, like do you not know how a anything about how anything works? Also, where are these phones from? Like what, 1980? Yeah. The local toy store. Mm. He said it! He said it! You're locked up! up. He said it! To you? Do you reckon you could sleep on something like that? Um, It's definitely doable. It won't be you comfy. Won't be it's like, it, you need a job. You need a job. Ah, yes. Skills? I've only just signed on. Work experience? Have you experienced the jobs <laughs> that the NFT community can provide you? I'm... I'm okay. <laughs> I'm not gonna Why don't you look at my minted NFT of Obama's <laughs> arsehole being fed by a Donald Trump giraffe? I know that. Why am I just expecting like a jo an English job center just to pop up in the middle of nowhere in, in <laughs> Thailand? <laughs> the only way you're getting that those stains out is if you're using a pressure washer. Yeah. Also, how did no guard see that switch? She's literally wearing a different jacket. And they stopped for ages. What, what are the guards watching? The trees? The birds? No, it's the girls being bent over. It's much better. No, in this film, it probably is that. Oh, my geez, it's oh, a bit from the oh. intro. Why do we need to see this? Because Jarrakhan had a hard on. Hmm. It, it's probably because. Well, it's, it's a, not even it's, that it's, because it's the in, asylum distributed this film. I was going to say it's, it's because, in, like. It's in slow mo with, like, nice, like, forest music. And yeah, I think he's trying to display the like shower. the showers are a place of comfort, which is just not true in a prison. They're probably like no. the most stressful part of a prison of the day. They are, the, yeah, they are literally the worst place to be as a prisoner if you haven't already got like gang affiliation or anything like that. Give yourself a death sentence. That's actually the worst person no. I've ever seen, and that cat no reminded me of you know in the uh, Just Weed and Justice League. Yes, where. Uh, they bring Superman back from the dead, mm. and Wonder Woman's just like, Kal-El, no! <laughs> That's always what I think of whenever she says that. Mm. Surely instinct as well has to take over at some point, and you start like trying to get them off you instead of just... Taking it like a there bitch. ...getting punched, yeah. Mm. Touch me again, I'm gonna beat your ass off. Right, what, why are they showing us this now? Right, I guess she's... A female, and uh, I'm, sorry, have, like, I'm, I'm sorry that, that, that you said a female the same way W2S said to an Eastern kid. A Muslim. Yeah, yeah. I know you are a Muslim, <laughs> but I know she is a female, and I know females tend to have less strength than the average male. Mm. But 30 seconds, two kilograms each hand holding it out. Come on now. Also, who drew that telephone sign? Could they not afford, like... Pro probably someone literally on the set five minutes before. Just, like, print one off. Mm. 
here we go. Viewer discretion is advised. Yep. Uh, please yeah. stop watching if you have any sense of taste. Normally, I wouldn't say that about one of my videos, but like, I, I think it's for the greater good. And now her clothes are oh, nice Jesus. close up. Sh yeah, that's what I say. Oh, Jesus. Some of the uh, editing and directorial choices in this film are quite confusing. Questionable. Questionable. Just remember, Mallory. Today is going to be the day <laughs> when they're going to throw it back to you. I said, maybe. <laughs> oh, oh my god, they're sparring, but they're doing it like they're at a girl's sleepover. Yeah. yeah. And it's about to be a precursor to like a Brazzers scene or something. There you go. Or a girl's gone what? wild scene. A, a, a girl's gone wild slash Brazzers scene. Or a girl's gone wild. Or a girl's gone Are wild. Are you sure scene. you can see this movie? Oh, no. On on that note, ladies and gentlemen, why don't you go and check out Taylor's other videos, like the Girls Gone Wild video? This is why I love you, Matisse. I don't <laughs> even have to plug my own videos. <laughs> Jared, you're taking the piss. Mm. If if you absolutely oh necessity, uh, no other way round it, have to, or the world explodes, you need this lesbian scene. Look it before the scene where she gets brutally assaulted. He was writing this scene, he was just... I am the coolest man alive. He went out, drank some whiskey, banged some hookers, did some cocaine, smoked some cigars, Listen to Andrew Tate in his Bugatti. <laughs> How many Bugattis do you have? Cool and alive. <laughs> what colour is your Bugatti? <laughs> <laughs> Plot twist. Like, knife, this is like a Undertaker versus Brock Lesnar too. <laughs> Except much, 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 much worse. The surrounding area reminds me of Sheffield. Just an absolute little dank shit hole. <laughs> like, because Sheffield's got the city centre, which is nice. Oh, then everything else Apart from is. that, mm. yeah, Sheffield is a dank, horrific little shit hole. Apart from Hillsborough, Hillsborough's nice. It's probably the best football stadium in the country. Mm. But yeah, if you go into South York, uh, well, yeah, anything in South Yorkshire is pretty shit. But yeah. Et, uh, South Sheffield is horrific. It's where Sheffield United have their stadium. I can't remember. Uh, Bramall Lane. That is a horrific, dang little shit hole. Mm. Oh, to a this... tiny, tiny, tiny football club. It's just really funny because it just looks like a. Do you know the end scene from Karate Kid? It just looks like a really shit version of that. <laughs> of, 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 of like the slow mo, like blocking the knee shot. And... Oh. The views. These are more than we ever gotten. Me, whenever I upload a good video. <laughs> you want more? The fans. You when you put you when you upload a teacup video. <laughs> I'm glad. Oh if my you gosh. win, you can go free, which is definitely something I, as the warden of a prison, have the power to, to do. do. Yeah. Apparently, there was a, a deleted scene from this film. You know. It, it was literally just Jared Conn banging a hooker in 16 different positions in 15 minutes right. while 13 waited outside begging for his massive penis. Really? He's just that cool. He was wearing sunglasses the whole time as well. No challenge. Just swallow it. Oh, she's gonna go for the power bomb. But Mallory heads back with a tombstone. <laughs> She's got her on the ropes. Straight into the steel cage. RKO out of nowhere. <laughs> and it's a 619 for Mallory. <laughs> Going for the FU. Not, not the five knuckle shuffle. Wow, that looks so real and not fake at all. Mm. With her smacking the hands down, I literally also, arresting it, it, it is quite literally also. I don't know who is who right now. Yeah, because they're both identical. Mm. Finish her. Finish it. <laughs> Get over here. <laughs> Fatality. Ah, uh, that's not a knife. This is a <laughs> knife. That's a spoon. 
<laughs> I see you've played Knifey Spoody Kill before. <laughs> now. What about her? <laughs> actually the dumbest part I imaginable. Too late. Easy? Oh my god, you can just tell their BB guns. You already did this also, like, they have the clearest shot imaginable. Just shoot her in the fucking head. Especially when she's done that. There's no threat to the warden at that point. Just You've fucking right. shoot her. Why has she now joined their side, the purple girl? Like, she was going along with all this bullshit. That was some terrible, terrible dubbing. Yeah. I gotta get to the US Embassy. And tell them what? Oh yeah, you know that place where I was legally detained for the crime I committed? I've just escaped and held their warden hostage. Yeah, I have committed an even bigger crime. Also, RZA. Absolutely love that. Yeah. That's what I get called all the time. <laughs> the RZA. Jesus Christ, okay. <laughs> um, uh, on that note, I don't really know how to... Uh, yeah. Uh, thank you all for watching. Suck your mum. <laughs>